Click the subscribe button for more of my videos. Thank you. Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Gabriel and I'm the Time Collector. And today we have this manual wine made by Tufina Watches, uh, Theorema Casablanca to be precise. And I hope you enjoy. I know very little about this watch. All I know by far is that it's made by Tufina and the brand is called Theorema Casablanca. As you can see, I heavily use this watch and for sure it has seen better days. Who is Tufina? Well, for all I know, the watch says it's made in Germany. Perhaps assemble or the case made in Germany. But the mechanical movement, it's a 17 joule manual wind only watch with a three atmosphere of water resistance. You really don't wanna get this one wet for sure. You wanna be careful with the trainee's movement. In the theory, my website, you can find this watch for 1,489 euros. Well, you can purchase the same exact watch at the Tofina website for only $349. Supposedly, in quotes, they're heavily discounted. Well, it's been discounted for two years. It's still at the same price. I will be listing the websites so you know. And if you want to learn a little bit about the history of the company, uh, it, it seems to be that uh, family owned business. But nevertheless, I'll let you watch some shots and then we'll get to the dimensions and measurements of this watch. All right, the watch has a case dimension of 44 millimeters with a bandwidth of 24 millimeters and a thickness of perhaps close to 15 millimeters. It's a really thick watch. It's bigger than the Tudor Black Bay Heritage. Uh, I really like the decoration in the back of the case. It's well decorated. It's very nice and finished as you can see, and it looks great uh, overall. It looks great. Uh, you can see these uh, crown guards here. Yeah. Once you get the watch, actually, it's pretty hard to get that crown guard out. It's not very easy to operate, but through the use that it will become a lot easier to just get it out and wind it. But well, you really don't need to get that crown guard out in order to wind the watch. You can just wind it. But you know, you have to change the time if you don't. You don't use the watch very often. There is no complications to this watch. Uh, I have very little to say about it. The bracelet is not of the best quality in my opinion. It's functional. It's functional and it's polished throughout. The whole entire thing is polished, actually. As you can see, it does wear pretty big. If uh, you are a person with a small wrist like me and you don't like big watches, perhaps this will not do for you. But I think it's a pretty attractive piece. It's not expensive. And uh, it does what it's supposed to. It's uh, legible. At least for me, it is a legible watch. Is it worth the purchase? Well, I look at it this way. It's definitely something different. I wish it would have used a better movement in it, as most Chinese movements are copy, 
and they won't last you that long. I have owned this watch for nearly two years and it works perfectly. It is an eye catcher and a conversation starter. While this video is coming to an end, I do want to say thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you like it, you comment on it, tell me what you think of it, subscribe so you can watch my future videos when they get released. Thank you and have a good day.